plaintiff, Barbara Irvin, says she and the defendant were dating the same man at the same time. And ever since the defendant found out, she's been making Barbara's life a living hell. Barbara is suing because she claims the defendant posted her phone number online so people would call and harass her. Defendant Mika Bride says when she started dating the man in question, he told her that Barbara was his probation officer. Mika claims Barbara is the one who's been harassing her, and she has the text messages to prove it. Mika's countersuing for the harassment. All rise. This court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Greg Mathis presiding. You may now be seated. Start with you. Your Honor, Mika has made my life a living hell. She's tormented me. January the 21st, a man that Mika and I were dating, that we didn't know each other were dating, I put him out when I found out about Mika. How did you find out? Um, he asked me to come to his job one day, and he always asked me to call before I would come. So I didn't. I just came to the location where he said he worked and waited there. And he came Me out and him of... him got the same situation. <laughs> <laughs> you know my wife be showing up here. Yeah. Saying that she, I ain't invited her. She just shows up. And she's right in the front. <laughs> what can I do? <laughs> All right, go ahead. And he came out of Mika Nails. I don't tolerate he that. He told you to come to his job. To his job. And which, you went to... Where? I went to the restaurant on the corner of Greenfield near Grand River. Oh, you all are in Detroit? We're in Detroit. All right. Greenfield, Grand River, a mile and a half from our community center. Yeah. Mathis Community Center, yes. 19300 Greenfield, <laughs> all seven miles. <laughs> Any volunteer efforts, please yeah. come and help. Yeah. All right. Now, with regard to coming to the job, I'm confused. He came out of the business next Thanks door. For the word. Correct. All right. Go ahead. And I asked him, uh, where, where are you doing at Mika Nails? You do nails? <laughs> That's right. How about getting his nails done? <laughs> no, that wasn't the case. All right. Well, long story short, I packed his things. No, what did he say? What, beyond? He, he, he said he was You seen. packed the man's stuff and before he could I, give you an I, answer? I like to pack quick. What? But what? <laughs> <laughs> What up. did the man tell you? What was his defense? His his defense was he knew her and uh, his daughter was getting her nails there, done there. But other friends of mine to get their nails done there said he had been there and he was seeing Mika nails off. All right. So I packed his things and I took him to her location and put him out. Her business? Her business. What things did you take into her business? Not into. I, said, I let them in front of her business. <laughs> what things? I took his clothes. His More than clothes. one bag? Oh, about four bags. Okay. <laughs> what happened after that? After that, I, I saw Mika, and I tried to tell her what she was getting, that he was a womanizer, a liar, a convict. <laughs> <laughs> was just trying to give her some information so she could draw her opinion, but she was so nasty. You knew all this while you oh, were dating her? I didn't know until I got into that. Okay, and you couldn't get out? I did get out. How long after getting Two in? Two months. Okay, good. And I left him with Mika. Good. He moved in with you within two months, though? No, he didn't move in with me. Why well, was his four bags of clothes there? He moved he's in. He's a sharp guy. <laughs> oh, he was, he was, oh, he was he good. Spends a lot hey. of, he spends all his money on clothes because he, that means he has two sets of clothes at two different houses. <laughs> and he got four bags at your house. It's so imagine good. what he has at his own house. <laughs> he did pretty what good. What does he have at his own place? I don't know if he has uh, No, place. you don't have another place. Go ahead, man. <laughs> So I put him at, out at Mika Nails. All right, and where do you know him from? Where do I know him from? Yes. I met him at the Bar Association's picnic. The Attorney Bar Association? No. <laughs> <laughs> the drinking bar. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go ahead. Go ahead, let me hear from you, ma'am. I don't even, this is my first time seeing this, her. Um, I was at the Riverwalk, okay? 
I'm out of my business exercising. He come up, how you doing? He proceeds to tell me that he works at the Salvation Army. That's next door to this, you know, telling me everything. Mm -hmm. So speed the story up. I, in turn, I start t how he was looking, like we would be together. It's like he's looking around. So I'm like, <laughs> what's wrong with you? I said, what's the problem? So I, everybody that I deal with or that I'm going to take into my life, I have to talk to God first. So when I talked to God, he led me, my spirit to believe it was a woman, but he wasn't having sex with the woman, but it was a woman. So after I sat him down in front of me, I said, you need to tell me something. I said, it's a woman. Tell me about her. What, you know, what is it? He stood there. I said, I'm hard as this nail table. You can talk to me. He said, she my probation officer. <laughs> uh, he said, she's my probation officer. Now that's a criminal He's movie. Home. I said, <laughs> go ahead. I said, now, do you know that you're wrong for that? She can get in trouble just as well as you can go back to jail. I said, but what are you going to do about this? Because I'm not going to deal with what you. What did he tell you he was living on this time? He told me that he was with her, staying at her house, just rooming oh, with her. Oh, staying at his probation officer's house. house. He was staying with her, rooming with her. Yeah, I'll take it back. He's not a smart criminal. Go <laughs> no, ahead no, and tell you no. that. Go so, ahead. After that, he's, you know, after, after after all that, I said, well, what you gonna do about that? Because I'm not finna deal with somebody. I said, then you 55 years old, you an old man, I got a business, I trying to run. Hold I've been on. doing slow this for Slow your road now, slow your road. <laughs> what was that about an old man? No, no, it's not about the old man part. 55 part, but you... is an old man. <laughs> I, I mean, have, I'm 44. You know, I have, you know, all the young girls in the country chasing after me. <laughs> so I ain't too old. I mean, <laughs> I mean that's, that's right. why my wife comes sit right uh -oh. there. <laughs> I mean, you know, so it's like, okay, what are you going to do? I said, I'm not going to deal with this. God don't bless no mess. I have a business to run. I said, and this, I can't do this. I don't want anything from you or her. I need you to leave. So in turn, when it was time for me, him to leave, her and her friends would call me making fake appointments. What is it you're about to show me? What is everything Miss Dale Robert Irving's been texting okay. and everything that she's been texting, I've been telling her to leave me alone. Let's hear from you, ma'am. You're suing her for harassment. How has yes. she harassed and defamed you? When they told me, the friend of mine that got her nails done on April 4th, that he had got her, I was elated and happy because of the way she had talked to me. That I texted her and told her last hi because I told her I would have the last laugh. I tried to tell you, God's good. She then got angry and posted on Facebook that if anyone wanted an old 65-year-old cougar to call Barbara and put my private number on there. You have a copy of that? Yes, I do, and well, I also have she audio. She just gave me a stack of texts. I also have audio where- I don't know who where... you think gonna sit up here and right. read 30 pages. Right. I also read 30 have... pages. <laughs> I also have audio. That it? That it? This is it. Okay. I also have audio where phone calls start coming in right away from where Nika, Mika had posted my phone number. You have the audio with you? Yes, I do. You have transcripts of it as you well? You have an audio that they Let can play see it, and I have please, and you can play it. Hello? This is being recorded. You don't know where to work? I'm at work recording you. Okay. Did you work? I'm at work recording you. She don't want to sit your house. Yeah, I put this shit out at right. the place. You sucker. Like your mom is a sucker. Yeah, mom is a sucker. Don't say nothing to them. Yeah, mama, my mama been a sucker. That's why y'all got her. You got eggs. No, you laying up with the down low. You the one the down low. Yeah, you got eggs. 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 Yeah, the plaintiff's relative. Yes, that's not me. she sells herself. And... That's not me. 
<laughs> Go ahead, ma'am. I woke up that morning on April the 4th. I can take those back and I could, you know, give you a sheet yeah, so that way you could see what's going on because I know you don't want to go. I, um, on the 31st, we were over with. April 4th, I guess up to, um, Dale Robert Irving, ha, 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 last laugh. I try to tell you, see how God worked. I never... Now, I did take her name to Facebook and I took it down immediately only because this woman here has been following me around the city of Detroit like the police. Thanks for your security. Because she's been following me. Every time I look up in my rear view, she's out there. Your counterclaim, what has she done? Followed you? She followed what me. Else? She has stopped my business. Um, we you are going to show me something. It's Texas. Because all I have from you, uh, fellas, if you're looking for old such and such right. to take care of you called Barbara. And, I took and then that, you I list did, her number. I did, Honor, take that, I I did take that down immediately because that's not my character. Your Honor, but she, she also she also stopped. And what she, you, go she ahead. also stopped. She keeps okay, coming by. Okay, you tell her to stop texting you. Now show me something after April 4th okay. where she texts you again after you told her to stop. After I told her to yes, stop? Yes, stop let's texting me. Is here's, the only thing April I see four, that gives you a April case four. if she texts you again. Yes, here's now, here, here April they all go. 4th, same thing. Here they all go. Show me something after April 4th. There is nothing. There, oh, no, it was all so April 4th. So she stopped 4th. texting you right. as and you then, requested. And then, what then, else she do? Friday, Friday, I'm sitting in my shop getting my hair done, and who proceeds to stop and point inside the shop? Dale Barber Irving. 30 minutes, she has caused my business as far as to me accepting new clients because she keep having people fake make fake appointments. Okay. I'm very leery. And she did mess with your business when she bought four bags, left them outside. What makes you think that doesn't make her look bad in front of her clients? Four bags of clothing in front of her place. They don't know whether it's hers. They can think it's hers. They know she messy anyway when she come in there. She talk, 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 tell yeah. everybody's business. That's why nobody in Detroit need to tell her your business because she gonna tell it. May I answer? No, I I, no, no, I'm you not going to tell I don't tell nobody's business. They well, all she, come to you and tell are, you that. Yes, I'm, the, I'm you everything. You got to listen to people's business I'm so all sick of day, listening. Don't. I'm sick of listening to them and look out the window <laughs> seeing her. Find something to do. Leave me alone. All right, harassment, I'll give you 3000 She clearly harassed you in a big way, putting this on the and internet. And I have more, y'all. No matter, you don't need more. That's all I'm giving you is 3000 <laughs> And you, ma'am, I'm going to give you 1500 because she should not have dumped those clothes outside of your business. But she didn't text anything after you told her to stop. Have a good day. That's my job. <laughs> To do. I need you to find you somebody Nigga, to you do need to something stop to do. Lying. No, you need to stop lying because and clearly, stop trying to act so clearly, holy. no, it ain't acting holy. Me it's so. not acting holy. Why you and chasing me? And let me tell you something. Why you keep chasing me? At I my haven't business? chased you. You shouldn't Why lie. Why you chasing? Who Talking lying? loud does Who's not lying? make you not Who's a liar. Lying? Tell me where I'm lying at, Barbara Bell Irving. Been to your Ir yes, you have. I've driven down. Girl, bye. I have bye driven Felicia. down. Bye, Felicia. I have driven down. Bye, Felicia. Alicia. This is the reason why I couldn't talk to Taz, you. Taz, you can't talk to because me. I don't have nothing to talk that. to you about. I'm not but dating not. you. I was dating him. But you're so you not. have nothing to talk to but me about. But I wasn't about. dating him. You need him. to talk to him I was and Jesus. To help him Jesus out. loves you. I'm not a probation officer. <laughs> Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. I know loves he loves you. me. Look at me. He loves me.